In this portion of the video, we're going to show you how to operate your Multilab 2 CPR multiple cuff selector. The multiple cuff selector has valves on it that allow you to port the air to whichever cuff you desire. When they're in the center position, these valves are off. To activate one of the valves, put them into the outside position or on position. Your remote also has start over again. Yep. <clears throat> this video is going to show you how to operate your Multilab 2 CPR multiple cuff selector. This has valves on it, five on each side, for the arm cuff, high thigh cuff, above knee cuff, calf cuff, and ankle cuff. When these valves are in the center position, they are off. To direct air into any cuff you desire, simply open that valve, or in the case of multiple cuffs like PVR operation, move them both two at a time. I'm set up now to do a pulse volume recording at the ankle, so I'm going to take number five left and right, move them into the out position. You will also notice there are remote control functions on your multiple cuff selector. So I can inflate, deflate, capture, set my volume, gain and bass slide, all from here. I'm going to inflate the cuffs now by simply pressing the inflate button. Once my PVR waveform steadies, I'm going to capture it. And then I'm going to scroll it on my screen by using my baseline down and my gain down. Baseline down is slow scroll, gain down is fast scroll. I'm now going to close these, open the calf cuffs, and take my waveform at that site. Now that my waveforms are scrolling, I'm going to capture. Scroll them to my liking. If I want to move one at a time, I can use my side button and scroll just the left side. Okay. Yep. Okay. That's good for me. Sound speeding. Got it. Yep. Okay. Pickups, uh, two CP semi-operation. When using your multiple cuff selector to obtain pressures, you will use one valve at a time. Right now I'm going to be taking a pressure at the left dorsalis pedis artery, so I'm simply going to open the left number five valve. Volume up a little bit. And inflate the cuff. Deflate. Capture. Close the valve after you capture so your patient is more comfortable and then scroll your waveform back to the first pulse.